Hey everybody, it's Sarah Humphreys. I just wanted to post a quick video uh, to thank everybody who's been sharing this Huffington Post article that I wrote. I have to tell you, this has been a crazy few days. Uh, I had no idea that when I wrote that, that it was going to really, I guess, touch a lot of people and, and a lot of people were going to connect with it the way that they did. Um, and it's been a little bizarre to go through this. You know, I went to the Today Show studios to film a segment and now they're not airing it. You know, that happens all the time, I guess, in the news, so I'm told, uh, in the news business. Uh, but I'm really, really happy that it got out there and it connected with people. I mean, I've received a couple emails from uh, young women and young men uh, who have set, who have thanked me for writing it, and that really moved me. I mean, it was a young woman who struggled with bulimia, and she said, I'm on the road to recovery, and this really inspired me, and, and that, man, that just made all the kind of negative stuff that I got, because there was some of that too, uh, that made it all worth, really worthwhile. And again, the whole event was unexpected. And um, I just want to reiterate one thing regarding my article. This article and my response was not about the size of clothes that he sells. It's not about fat versus thin. It's about kindness versus cruelty. We have a choice in the way that we message our products. And I feel that Mr. Jeffries chose wrong. He chose divisiveness and cruelty over kindness. So I just want to really thank everybody who's sharing the article and uh, please keep sharing it. And remember to those young people who are out there who might have read the article, who might be seeing this, who are feeling like they're not part of the cool crowd. First of all, I don't know who decides what's cool. It's certainly not Mr. Jeffries. That's number one. And secondly, find whatever your passion is, whatever lights you up inside and makes you feel great about yourself. When you find that, run with it. And find a way to make that your career and make that a big part of your life because that really is the true key to happiness. Find your passion, find your light. And when you get to that place that you feel really, really good about yourself because of what you're doing, what you're creating, then nobody and nothing can touch you. And remember, you matter and you're awesome. And thank you to everybody who's sharing the article. You guys rock. Peace. Dream on. And remember... Play nice in the sandbox of life. Don't be mean. <laughs> Dream on, everybody. Bye.